What up, y'all? Matt Burke here again, coming to you from what is soon to be the newest skate park here in Tallahassee. It's the skate park that I have been talking about on this channel for almost two years at this point. And Team Payne has finally announced it. They've finally put out the very first draft of a design that they've put together for this location. And we've also just got the date for the very first community input meeting that we are gonna be having next week on November the 18th. I am super, super excited for that whole meeting so that we can finally talk to them, see more into this first draft, and also see what other kind of designs they have put together. I obviously have a very, very strong input on wanting to have as many round rails and round coping as possible at this park. Since the other park is mainly transition and doesn't have any real street elements to it anymore, since that rail got knocked off, so I am really, really hopeful that we are gonna have a handful of handrails over here, maybe some ledges with some round coping in it. But as you can see from the picture that's on the screen right now, I am sitting pretty much right in the middle of where that street park is going to be. You can see this big pole behind me, and that is also the pole that is in the exact same location on the photo that you're looking at right now. So I'm really, really excited to see that this is the first draft that they have put together. There's already so much stuff on this first draft that we just don't have at the current park. So there's gonna be a lot more obstacles that I'll be able to learn on, a whole lot more obstacles that I'll be able to progress on, and a whole lot more things for me to do that do not involve me going over to FAMU and almost breaking my back again. I'm finally starting to heal up from that. I can finally move my arms and kind of do everything that I need to with some limitations. So that at least gives me a little bit of relief knowing that the healing process is moving forward relatively quickly, but I am still gonna be quite cautious about the shenanigans that I get myself into once I heal up a little bit. But I did just wanna walk you through where this location is, show you what it looks like right now, because as I've mentioned in my last videos, I am gonna be tracking the progression of the build over here at the park, because it is something I've been waiting such a long time for, and it's also something that I'm just super interested in as well. So I'm looking forward to whenever we finally have these meetings that I've mentioned, and also just really looking forward to whenever they finally break ground. And one of the main things that I am excited about is if you look right behind me, there's a blue building closest to me and then there is a salmon colored building right behind that one and that is where I work. So I can literally see my job from the skate park that I'm gonna be spending all of my time at and my house is literally only, I think, like 1.2 miles that way. So no matter what's going on, whether I have work or not, I'm gonna be able to come over to this skate park, get here way faster than I get over to the other skate park. And also, as you can see again in the photo, there's just so much more life to this skate park, even in this first draft. As you've seen at the skate park that I've been skating at for these last couple years, it's literally just concrete and fence, and the building right behind the skate park currently is a jail. But again, this is just another short video. I have to keep posting videos weekly on this channel or else all of the progress that I've made over the last six or so months just completely gets diminished by even missing one upload. So I do apologize for all of the talking that I have been doing in these last few videos. But like I said a few minutes ago, my body is starting to heal up a whole lot quicker than I had anticipated. So I am hoping that next week I will be able to get out on my big wheels and do some more low impact skating and just kind of get my feet on some wheels again and get myself rolling around. But with all that said, I'm gonna get myself out of here, go home, do whatever the hell it is that I have to do for the rest of the day, rest and relax a little bit, get myself ready for this work week that does begin tomorrow. But as I get going, I am gonna just take a walk and show you guys how close this job is to the skate park. So as I'm doing that, if you guys have liked this video, do me a favor, hit that like button down below. If you are not subscribed to this channel yet, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button down below. And if you'd like to be notified as soon as these videos are uploaded to this channel, hit that little notification bell down below so that you will be notified as soon as that does happen. And as always, y'all stay safe out there and I will see you next time.